Well, it's a waiting game for thousands in Montgomery looking for affordable housing vouchers. According to the Housing Authority, there are 1,100 units. 96% are occupied. And that's why the city is counting on a federal grant announced today to get some residents a home. WSFA 12 News reporter Julia Avent shows us how it works. The Selwyn Montgomery Voting Rights Trail uh, in West Montgomery, just an area that has been underserved for so many uh, years in the past. Now Montgomery is getting much needed funding from the federal level. City leaders announced Montgomery received $3.5 million from the National Pro Housing Program. It allows us to preserve uh, some of those houses that uh, we want to and believe can be rehabilitated. It also removes the barriers from condemning some houses so that we can build new. Montgomery Housing Authority Acting President and CEO Glennis Tanner says this money is much needed. We got new things coming in, new uh, jobs, new um, companies relocating to Montgomery along with the ones that we have just the low income. She hopes more affordable units will become available so they can give more housing vouchers to the thousands of applicants currently waiting for a place to call home. Everyone should be eligible, should have access to affordable housing. I don't care if it's a zero income family to an income of two, three hundred thousand a year, but we all need a place to rest our head, a decent, clean, place to rest our heads at night. Val, the $3.5 million is a part of the $85 million be award, being awarded to cities nationwide through this program. All right, thank you, Julia. Mayor Reed says the city will also focus on making homes more energy efficient.